Hey guys, Casey here, Anchor Investments. Here to give you an update on our triplex near UMED here in Anchorage. Uh, where we're at, this is kind of, we're still in the early stages of doing our remodel. What it is, is it's a big duplex in the back and then a small bungalow house attached on the front. We're gonna skip the bungalow for now. I think uh, we're gonna be have a chance to jump in there in the next couple of months and uh, start working on it. But for now, I wanted to kind of get a before video as we're mid-reno in the main building. So the plan is, so this is our main entryway. This door goes down to the basement. And this is our smaller two-bedroom unit. So you can see we have stuff everywhere. This is one of the bedrooms here. A nice big bedroom. Uh, kitchens here on the far side. We're going to be completely replacing this kitchen, doing all new flooring and paint, a lot of new lighting and stuff throughout. Uh, back here through this hall is our main bathroom, and it's completely gutted right now. We're going to be replacing the tub and surround, uh, probably replacing the toilet and doing a new vanity here. Okay, as we come down the hall, we have the garage on our left. Obviously, it's full of uh, supplies. They're also building a deck onto the back, so that's what some of this stuff is for, some of this treated wood. Um, obviously, mid-reno, we have a ton of supplies and tools here. Uh, the guys are really getting after it. Today's Saturday. That's why you're not seeing any guys here working. This is the back bedroom, so this is the second bedroom of the main floor unit. And... Um, we're just gonna be doing some new paint and flooring in there. And then we have our uh, laundry room. So that's about it for the lower unit, the two bedroom. Upstairs right now, uh, the unit is also only two bedrooms, but one of them is enormous and we're gonna be expanding it to be a three or four bedroom unit. Um, I believe currently the plan is to do four bedrooms. So I think when this place was originally designed, this upper unit was kind of the owner's unit, and so it's huge. Uh, expands over the garage. I believe this was meant to be the master bedroom. It's absolutely gigantic. And so we're gonna be splitting it down the middle here and making it into two different bedrooms. And then this was the walk-in closet, and it's gonna be the fourth bedroom. It's, this is bigger than an average bedroom. It's probably 12 by 15 or so. Then through here, we've completely gutted this uh, bathroom. It did have some really old school uh, dark tile that was pretty hideous. So we took it out and we're gonna do a full remodel in there. So that's three bedrooms here on that end, back into the living area. Once again, we've got cabs on order, so we're gonna be putting in a brand new kitchen up here. But this is the before kitchen. That's the door that leads out to the new deck that they're building. And then this is a huge kind of side room, storage slash pantry, and it's gonna have a new laundry in it as well. That way we have laundry up and down for each unit. So we go down the hallway, uh, there is our fourth bedroom on the right, and then another bathroom straight ahead. Once again, we've gutted almost this entire thing. I believe all this tile is gonna to go too, and we're gonna do new tub and surround, new vanity, new flooring. Uh, throughout here. So that's the project so far. Uh, the guys have been really getting after it. I think we're going to wait to go through the bungalow unit until um, probably January or February update, but that's what we have going on. When we're finished with this, it's going to be beautiful. We're going to furnish and decorate it and turn it into Airbnbs, short-term, mid-term rental. We're only two blocks south of Providence Hospital, so it's excellent location. Hope that helps.